What is going on, people? Welcome back. Johnny here. Rimworld. Can we... No, these are always made out of steel. This is the Triple Cold Snap Mostly Vanilla Ice Sheet game. I think in the interest of not running out of steel when we start getting raided again, I'm just going to smelt, smelt those. We do need money, though. I think we're... All of our plasteel has been delivered, so we are covered on plasteel. Somehow I did not provide enough uranium, though. Damn it. <laughs> I thought we were there. I counted. So something is using uranium. I bet it's bionics. No. We, we shouldn't have made our swords out of uranium is one thing, right? That's okay. We'll get a trader. Hopefully before... If, we're end up, if we end up waiting on uranium, I'm just going to be the most fucking disappointed dude on the planet. Nobody has anything to do. Schedule. Everybody's unrestricted. It doesn't freaking matter. I can't build anything because we need all of our components and advanced components for this nonsense. So we're waiting on three advanced components, six advanced components, six advanced components, six advanced components. Ouch, 18. 21 advanced components, and that means 21 regular components because it takes regular components to build advanced components. And you might ask, why don't you build another fabrication bench? Because it takes 12 components. <laughs> so first I have to build 12 components. <laughs> then I have to build two more to make advanced components. It's just this fucking... Oh, these dicks are here and they're attacking immediately. And they're going to use extremely clever tactics. But what they don't know is that it's negative fucking 200 degrees out. So their clever tactics <laughs> are going to lead to their own demise. <laughs> Alright. Zone clear. Uh, no, no. Clear inside. I just... Uh, no, okay, we're cool. I don't think they're going to be able to do too much damage, but I uh, don't know. They don't have a... I should sprinkle a few, few of these babies around out there, and I think I will, just to cover every angle. I don't want to do it now, though. Plus, we the component problem. I guess we should probably go outside and greet these sons of bitches. I'm not going to turn on my guns. I don't think we're going to need them. Hopefully somebody brings something made out of fucking... Ah, oh, you D-bags. Stop doing that. There goes my fucking traps. It's so frustrating, dude. Um, Alright, I want people with swords over there. People that are hidden back in the corner and not able to shoot. Come over here. Are they still going to destroy my guns even though my guns are off? We could just literally go inside. I was hoping to save the traps or something, but that's clearly fucking not going to happen. Oh, what's going on over here? Oh, God. We left the door open over there. Why is the cold not dropping these fools? <laughs> Why don't... Let's just double check how the cold's affecting them. Minor? Only 32. Well, I guess we'll... I guess we'll, uh... I'll get on their ass. Oh, nope. We don't want to get hurt. Run away. Run away. Run away. Oh, we have shields. It's fantastic. I gotta pay attention to my own issues with the cold here. I should probably make those three other parkas because these fucking muffalo ones are garbage. Yeah, you, you, and you all have those. You're fucking everybody's minor. Let me just go inside. Piss on this. You guys just fucking deal with the weather. <laughs> they're, all, they're starting to go down here. So I really did something stupid there because uh, look at this moron. Let's hit the one we can't possibly get through. Ah, shit. Now they're going to... Okay, it's not all of them. They, I hate how they bash up stuff on the way out. Like there's a clear path out, but you're going to bash up the closest fucking doors because you're a bunch of assholes. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Every trap gone. Well, that gives us something to do anyway. Wait, all right, how's Nicole doing with this weather? You're shivering at 10. It's not really worth any injury for a bunch of gear we don't need. So I'm just going to kind of let it go. All right. We are, yeah, we're just not going to do shit. Piss on it. This went out for a little. Oh, look at Stuart. What a, what a genius. 
All right, uh, schedule everybody inside, unrestrict, sorry, uh, undraft everybody. Uh, just ignore what's going on out here because we don't give a shiza right now. <laughs> it's a trail of carcass. You can tell who has the best gear because they make it the furthest. Okay, furthermore, we will go out and gather anything that looks useful. We also have to clear out the carcasses. They don't just drop uranium, sadly. <laughs> oh, we do need to make a bunch of traps. That'll give us... Why can't I do a fucking build copy on that? Ugh. Oh, look, we don't have any traps over here either. Well, I got something for people to do now. Slate traps orders. I don't think any wall segments were destroyed anywhere. I think they tried, but didn't really get anywhere. Anyways, slate traps. I wish I had somewhere that I could, like... like an it's really cold in this room, too, so I might as well just build the goddamn things outside if I'm going to build them in here, so never mind that. All right. Slate trap. I guess we can build them in a few groups and then set them outside and build more. I better not put any in a legitimate walking area because if they start stepping on them, it's going to be more than a little bit frustrating. All right. That's that. Nobody step on a trap. <laughs> I don't know how many I even need. <laughs> Looks pretty entertaining just to sprinkle traps around the inside of your fucking base, though. So. All right. Beautiful. Here, you can stuff a couple in here, too. Probably we'll turn this on and start bringing chunks, right? If the batteries hold, who cares? There you go. I'll get at least... Oh, nice. I'm mine. I'll get the... Oh! Sheep wool. Whatever. Still, it's uh, more steel, and uh, we can make something with it. What were we going to make in terms of this? I did... It says I made a parka. I wasn't making any parka. I did... No. I do need three parkas. <sighs> Damn it. We... Yeah. And these are guinea pig fur, so they're doing great. All right, how's Martin doing over here? All right, small sculpture completed. Very nice. Turn out good. It's going in Martin's bedroom. Give him something to do in there instead of pulling his tallywhacker. Holy shit, 500 silver. That's nice. That guy must have been the chief or some shit. Okay, with the cargo pods, bro. So <laughs> Megasloth meat. I'd rather have Megasloth wool. Man. I guess we have plenty of that. All right, the meat's important. We don't want that to go unrestrict health all right uh, if I come out here first cancel the steel maybe we'll actually get all the fun shit that we want in terms of uh, why not yeah that should work <laughs> let's put these on a regular haul and see if the, she's wise enough to just pick up the shit we want she's doing great so the fucking guinea pig fur makes such a difference all right now you my lady all this nice work, Nicole. See, that's oh god, this is <laughs> this is not good. <laughs> oh well, she definitely saw a carcass there. No reason to break pick this fucking thing up. What's the value on that one? Eighty three bucks. Ugh, whatever. This guy needs to go in. There's still just. I don't know what it's worth to pick up over here and what it's not. Like, obviously the bodies have to go, but the bows and shit, can we, can we just not pick the bows up? I'm hoping not. Who's that? That's somebody that tried to bash up my door. We do have to get out and do a bunch of repairs, but it's negative 220 degrees. I don't really foresee that happening anytime soon. We also are going to need extra clothes for this new bro. So if it's a parka to travel wear. A marble meteorite. A lot of shit falling out of the sky this episode. All right, and now we have a transport pod relationship. Gray is with the pistol partners. Stuart's brother. Do I even want to fucking see? Where is he at? There, oh, he's close. Creepy breathing. Well, he's not joining our king colony, so get ready for some a high level of negativity. I guess we'll take his shit because he's a. He's an enemy, but this is not going to make our people happy at all. 
Alright, you can then unrestrict. Where are you going, dude? Hauling shit? No, just haul these things in. Alright, anyways, we're still making traps. So I had these traps, and they were, like, springing them in and setting them up. Which is frustrating, so I had to cancel the traps that were underway with that plan and actually rebuild them again. I'm going to need more traps than we have. I don't like having traps everywhere. But... All right, there we go. Let's look at this. What's going on with this? Oh, they're just waiting for resources to come in. Okay, cool. So now I just have to find all the traps and set all the traps up. And since we're not like... No, what is that then? That's a wall. Why the hell is that? I grabbed the wrong thing. Since we're not under duress in terms of constant assault, we're not going to use the extra traps we've built and have in storage for the moment. We're just going to make them because we can, because we have the capacity. Nobody really had frack all to do anyways, so let's just uh, put, them to, put them to work. I don't know how we're going to get outside and do all these repairs, but... It's a whole other story, I guess. I just noticed we had 25 herbal meds out here that are going to waste. I think we can probably stop growing herbal meds and flip back the rice on those. Ooh, are those ready for harvest? No, but they will be very soon. It's okay. We have 25 sitting outside. I'm just going to let it go. Nicole, I need you to come do this, dude. They're in bad shape. But hey... It's fine. I'm just going to cut your losses. Also, then, if we're not going to be making any more medicine, which we're not, we can we can go back to food. I was getting a little nervous about all the people we had. And uh, let's do... Do we need money anymore? Not really. I guess we'll just go food. We're sitting on it quite a bit, but we've also been bringing meat in, so... Why the fuck are there all those packets for wild meals? You better not be making those, no. No. What happened to all that meat Nicole just brought in? I guess they've already used it. Why are you... Oh, she's hauling shit. I unrestricted everybody, so I have to keep a close eye on what's going on here. <laughs> oh, yeah, like this. You inside. You. You. If you don't have guinea pig fur, you don't last long. All right, you two are going in here. Ugh, are we gonna take frostbite here? And not, not our when. <laughs> Fucking somebody better not have ran down south somewhere. Schwartz is serious, but he's restricted. Carney is shivering with asthma. I <laughs> Dolly's trying to build a goddamn ship. She's serious and is frostbitten now. Uh, yeah. This is why unrestricting everybody was a bad. I was hoping I'd get my trap set up, but what I actually got done was a bunch of bodies hauled. But we can't be nonstop staring at carcasses, can we? Nicole's going to eat a meal outside. I mean, I know it's it's a pretty warm day for eating meals outside. Have a nice little picnic and a fucking ice sheet. <laughs> Black, you. Oh, Black's not even cold yet. He's like, there's some dubers, Brosif, and I want. Und I want them. <laughs> All right, I'll go with Martin here. So we've flipped the full food production and the understanding that we're probably not going to need money because we should have plenty of shit to sell to acquire the last little bit of uranium we need. Ugh, we didn't get anything done. I think they are getting traps built, and that's fucking more important than anything, I guess. Uh, we do need to make another round of traps to put over here. We're actively deep drilling. Uh, we don't have anything to smelt. Uh, I guess I can leave it on, though. The batteries don't seem to be suffering at all, so who cares? Anything else we really want? Nobody's going over here. How are you doing with this cold? You shouldn't really see anybody else outside except Nicole. I mean, I'm going to let these go. They're almost done anyways, and... Whatever, do we, do we really need to deal with that? You go inside, too. I think maybe one of the keys is to unrestrict everybody, like, for maybe two hours or something. I wish I could set up unrestricted auto schedules so they'll spend an hour outside, just haul a couple bodies, get back inside, that kind of thing. It would be nice if I didn't have to babysit that so much. This dude's going to join us soon. I might have overdone it after, after that dude does 
uh, I was hoping all those fucking things would be moved by now. <laughs> I don't want them sitting around like this, so let's uninstall them. Yeah, we'll set up a bunch of right here too. One thing that would be nice is if uh, to have money. You know, I've been kind of just not bothering with shit, but it would be nice to be able to buy a bunch of meat. That's for sure. We do have all these flak pods. More cargo pods isn't bad. <gasps> Ask my people and you shall receive the quote the Lord Jesus Christ. <laughs> there you go. Uh, no, we're, I'm looking for Nicole. There she is. Uh, are you cold? I guess we don't have to run out immediately. <laughs> Holy crap. Yeah, you couldn't have had better timing. Oh, somebody did destroy a wall. Look at that. That's no point. No good thing the dolly's on top of shit. Why don't you... I mean, it's no warmer in there right now. And, uh... I want that wall finished though. Get inside quick, Dolly. Quick, quick, quick. All right, Nicole is doing repairs. So what's a good use of time for Nicole? Why don't we, I want everybody inside so I can send Nicole out for a long walk. I'm gonna, I put another zone here that's closer so we can just drag them in the middle and then we'll hit them with, oh shit balls. Dolly is not doing great here. Rescue Dolly. I need Dolly's shit brought in too. How bad is Dolly getting frostbit? She's extremely frostbitten. All right, and then Nicole, whom I want to go outside and do shit. Schwartz, you unrestrict him. Come down here and haul this shit for me. I had to switch Boyro up and make her, uh, make her build shit. Sorry, make her tailor. She hasn't fucking got in nothing done. Details. Boyro. Boyro. But we need the best gear we can get here. Schwartz, health. All right, Nicole, unrestricted. Go get that meat. Get ready to see a bunch more carcasses too. Uh, suspend the meals again. Don't want to use all of our rice on stuff we don't have to. All right, see that's going a lot faster. We are going to see a lot more carcasses, but we will also be able to burn them easier. Oh yeah, you're taking that one outside. That's genius. I don't understand why you made that choice, but. Uh, hopefully she brings in the steel too. She didn't get it all, but that's fine. So she's shivering at 16%. Yeah, we are mid. This is the coldest day of the year, actually. Shorts. Where the fuck are you going? Seeking safe temperature. Why don't you seek safe temperature? He's going to go down here. No, I think she'll be all right, actually. This has been the worst pawn I've had in a while. <laughs> Stuart, get ready to rescue Shorts. Okay, she made it. She did suffer frostbite, and that's why you don't leave your people up. Oh. Unrestricted. Why don't I check that zone? Something might be a little fishy there. Oh, inside. She was seeking warm temperatures outside of an allowed zone. That's interesting. I don't know. Whatever. We're getting more steel. Or sorry, more slate all the time. I don't want the traps in here. I guess they don't have access to these zones, so that's where they're going to put them. I am going to... Did I get all the traps taken taken down? And Yeah, okay. So I think we're going to build another round of traps, too. Seems like good, solid winter work. Building... Oh, I didn't put one in over there, either. Damn it all. Install that one. There, okay. Away from these and set up. Oh, we did build a door somewhere to put in on there, too. <laughs> there we go. And building more... Whoop building more traps. Let's get that done too. We need to fill up the traps on the other side. Our backup trap corridor. And, uh, that shit could... No, oh, that's a really bad spot right there. <laughs> Cancel that one, please. It's not gonna go well. Major break risk on Nicole. She probably cold. Hungry, cold, observed corpses, you name it. All right, so we did get a little extra steel. Uh, I'm going to restrict everybody inside. It is bedtime, so that's just fine. Man, trying to keep everything together here in this climate. It's a major headache. Okay, you have to be shitting me. <laughs> uh, that one's not as exciting, but... It's free shit. <laughs> well, I guess I'll have Nicole go retrieve that too. Really would have liked more meat. 
How much shit fell out of the sky? Five people left tattered apparel. We're never getting this done. I guess we have a whole season, or sorry, a whole year almost to get back. So it should be fine. I mean, feeding Martin. How the fuck does Martin have all the good meals? <laughs> What's Nicole doing? All right, I want you to haul Nicole and see a bunch of bodies and get really upset. <gasps> okay, hold on. Fuck the food for the moment. Combat suppliers buy this shit. <laughs> Haul as many of them, and these fuckers too. And these, they'll buy all this shit if we can get it in there quick. Uh, arena. Oh, unrestrict, undraft. Is Nicola? No. Alright, good. Get all those brought in. ASAP. Here, these are closer. Alright, we should be able to rack in a little bit of cash on this shit. The fact that they can carry a ton of them. I'm going to just make them, <laughs> drop them where I want here too. Alright, so Arena there, Nicole. Ah, for piss sake, she dropped it right there. Pick that up. Okay, there you go. Alright, anyways, gear. Look, <laughs> fucking making money, people. Hand over fist. This stuff's probably not worth fuck all, right? Alright, you... You go do whatever you want. You didn't really bring in that much. I guess your capacity's lower for some reason. All right, I'm not even gonna try making a second trip out there. What's that? Okay. I'm gonna have Nicole stand right over here and get ready to make this fucking go there. Goddamn. Arena's going out for another round. Yeah, uh, yeah, just go in, please. Okay. For this one little pillow, <laughs> we wait the whole goddamn thing. Okay, Nicole now. Undraft, combat supplier. Bam. All right, now let's see if that was worth it. So for future reference, I mean, some of these bows have been sitting outside for a million years, so that's fine. Now, for future reference, we ended up with, like, fucking less than 300 bucks. That's totally not worth it. We do have seven reinforced barrels, which we don't need. Getting rid of these drugs too. They have components. I'm gonna buy them since it's one of our main fucking things holding us back. Cinderary launcher normal that can go. And Cinderary launcher good times two. We only need one of those. We have four assault rifles. We don't really need four assault. These are damaged assault rifles too. I'm gonna I'm gonna keep one of those and one one undamaged. Ooh, EMP launcher. I like EMP grenades, but. So, a couple of sniper rifles can go. Frag grenades. We have a bunch of those somewhere. Wooden war mass. Flak best. This is what we've been waiting to sell for a long time. Okay. We have statues that we've been making to sell, too. So, that's fantastic. And an extra shield belt. All right. There you go. So, like, $3,000 is pretty good, right? Uh, so, do you have anything made of uranium? 500 bucks, but we're desperate. We do have one uh, yeah, that we don't want to sell. I'm tempted to buy this. I know it's really stupid, but we need uranium, and that's our only source. That's a golden long sword. Jeez Louise, 15126 bucks. I think they'll smelt that down right away. So that's fine. We'll see what we end up with in terms of uranium. And then we, sh we should have extra plasteel to be able to make plasteel sword, at least one plasteel sword. And we're going to keep this uranium longsword. We might have to smelt one because I think we're 30 to 40 short. Well, we'll see what we get for that one breech axe and if it looks like it's going to be worthwhile. Anything else made out of uranium? Can I sort these by name? Name. That's... No, that's it. Okay. All right. Accept. All right, well, we cashed in big time. Now we just need somebody else to come over here and help us out. Arena, you can just go back inside. I don't want you outside anymore. Where did that breach axe end up? Right there. Nicole, can you... What are you working on? Relaxing socially. Yeah. All right, we're going to bring it in. We'll see who smelts it and what we get. And then we might... Where the hell did it go? Oh, it's right there. <laughs> Anybody want to do that for me? Arena? What are you working on? 
does it matter their skill? Like, if you're really good at this shit, so if I have Boyro do it, am I going to get more? I guess if there's any chance of that, it's worth doing it that way. I think we needed 35 more. Let's see. No, we have... Four, yeah, we have 45. We need... 70. So we need 25. And I may have gotten... No, I... How much did she get? 12. Fuck. <laughs> Alright, smell the goddamn longsword, too. I don't think it matters who does it. I think it was this one. Uh, I'm gonna... What is this about? Do this once. Details. Longsword. We should probably get to making another longsword. So here's the next issue. This is not... This is not right. There you go. Okay, uh, we need to set, uh, where's that smelting? This, the electric smithy. We can actually take this electric smithy apart after this is done, though, so that's cool. I'm going to shift this over a tick. I can put them both in here. Things are getting a little bit crowded, but that should be fine. Uh, I'm going to wake Boyer up and do this. I just need to see if we're going to get enough material for this long sword. So we need 13 more. Please, for the love of everything in this world. Oh, yeah, she got plenty. Okay, good. Just in case something ever goes south, I'm going to fix that job. Okay. If this is far away, we can safely ignore it. That's a holy fuck. <laughs> Ten centipedes, dude. <laughs> Oof. I'm gonna see how far away it is. It's gonna spread to a hundred from the ship. So this one is not gonna hit our plants. This is its maximum range, and it's gonna like swoop down through here somewhere. Oops. So uh, we can ignore that. That is a f shitload of centipedes. Holy fuck. If they happen to come inside and get caught in our guns. Oh fuck Nicole. That is gonna be bad. That's the end of the that's the end of our fucking game right there, man. So we better not to, I wanna wake them up, but I don't want them to come attack me. No, 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 no. N fucking meal eating idiots. I hate when they do that. Get this. I guess that's more important. Anyway, it's time to go for the day. Please leave a like if you're enjoying. Pray to God I'm correct on this because it's a good thing I didn't start any more growing over here. Again, if I wake them up and we get raided, they should take out a. F this is going to be fantastic for the end game, actually. Thank God that's not a psychic ship. Because that's like anybody that comes to attack us, probably, except for other mechs, probably going to like, oh, we're coming around here. Look at these fuckers. Blah, we're dead. Yeah, okay. I'm, nothing I can do about it anyway, so it is what it is. All right, guys. I love you. I'll see you. I'll see you next time. Do we get all these? Nope. All these traps uninstalled. <laughs> and then installed where we need them. Oh my god, I'm shaking. This this is the game ender right here, dude. I don't know what to do. Uh, hey, Martin's gonna recruit. See ya.